Hey guys, um, today is Monday and wow, did that take me like a minute to figure out what today was. <laughs> um, ignore the voice, it is very raspy, um, cold maybe, and just a bunch of stuff, I don't really know. Um, <clears throat> so I'm pretty sure I'm getting sick and I put my glasses on because my eyes look horrible and I didn't really want you guys to see how puffy and swollen and red they look and all of that stuff. But anyway, I wanted to talk about probably what everybody else is talking about and some of you may not like what I'm going to talk about. But some of you may not care, some of you might be mutual on the whole thing, and you know, whatever. But I'm going to go there and I'm going to talk about Miley Cyrus. Um, okay, so if you watch the VMA Awards, obviously you, you know that what was going on in that performance. like. I don't even know where I should start with all of that. Um, it was a very odd performance. Um, I already knew that Britney or Britney. Well, yeah, I mean, they're both from they both were from Disney, Britney Spears and Miley. So it kind of tells you a little something, perhaps maybe tiny, tiny little bit. Disney, Disney, Britney, Miley, both. A little crazy, a little gray. Um, but if you think about it, uh, I, I knew that Miley was kind of going downhill before this performance happened. Um, now, if you think about it, her song, We Can't Stop, is about drugs, rolling around on drugs and twerking and, and just a bunch of stuff. And the thing that I feel very, very odd about is because I know she's not Little Miley from Hannah Montana anymore, but keep in mind that most of her fan base is young girls. I mean, I don't think that she realizes that most of her fans are still girls her age or girls younger than her, you know, they think of her as Hannah, Ma Hannah fucking Montana, and, um, you know, like, I personally, I enjoyed her music back in the day when her hair was long and, and, and she was innocent, and, um, I, I liked the song The Climb, and, you know, I thought that that song had a lot of emotion, and it really touched me, um, but now her songs are about drugs and being on drugs. So we all know that she's obviously on drugs, so that's a bad thing. I mean, especially like I don't know, you shouldn't you're you're exploiting all these young girls to that. And she obviously has an eating disorder, which is not healthy either. Um I don't know, and she bashes gays, and I just don't think that that's cool. I mean, when she first cut her hair, she was like, oh, how I look like a lesbian. She tweeted something about how she looked like a lesbian, and um, how she thought she looked like Ellen DeGeneres. And then she kind of like bashed gays, and now she's trying to go for like a pink slash Lady Gaga look. And let me just tell you, Miley. I usually am not a hateful person and I really usually don't judge, but um, you will never ever be like Pink. I mean, Pink is just fucking awesome. I mean, like, flat out, just hands down, the best fucking artist in the world. And Lady Gaga, I mean, she's very artistic. Yes, she may dress odd and, and strange, but I mean, that doesn't mean anything like I just think that she's very all for equal rights and equality and she does a lot for the world and for humanity and that's that's awesome and 
to me, those are all kinds of things that in my book matter. When you're rolling around and you're hyped up on the, uh, something called Molly, I think it's a drug, um, and you're twerking and you're pretty much like fingering yourself with the foam thing, like she was like, what was she doing? Like she was on, she, after she twerked, right? Cause she was like, what was she doing? Like she bent over, she completely bent over and put her ass and was like, ah. and then she had that foam finger and was like, whoosh. And she's like fucking flinging it around and like touching her crotch like every five seconds. And <clears throat> why? Like, I don't understand. And then come out in a fucking bear suit? Like, what is that? And then you're dancing around with big giant bears that have like asses. Like, I don't have an ass, so don't judge me. But like, that were like bigger than I can even imagine um, and she's like going like that and touching on like I don't understand that she comes out with this bear thing on and she just whoosh, rips it off and she's in like a nude bikini or something I don't even know what it was it looked like plastic but it was just horrible like absolutely horrible <laughs> I mean like um, I don't know, I just, I don't understand, I don't know if she's going through, I don't know, she's obviously going through something, and we obviously haven't figured that out yet, um, maybe we won't, but I think, when I think about it, I'm like, well, what happened to little, little, my, little, oh, it's really dark right here, hang on, hold up, <laughs> okay, um, it makes me think, like, what happened to little Miley? Like, I, I just... And then I think to myself, well, what's her dad thinking right now? He's probably like, Miley, you broke my heart. My achy, breaky heart. Mm -mm. I mean, really, think about it. Miley, what is happening to you? Um, I just... I don't know. Um, I don't know what's going on with her. I really feel bad because she's being so bashed and stuff, but at the same time, she's got to be going through something. She's rebelling or she's just... I guess her ratings were really bad though, like they weren't good, so I'm wondering if she's doing all this for attention and stuff like that. But I mean, that's not the way to go. Like, if you want to... I'm just saying, if you want uh, attention, right, why would you go about doing it that way? Because obviously, that is the wrong way to go about it. You don't, you don't write a song about drugs and, you know, rolling around on drugs and twerking and putting your ass on someone's cock. You just don't do it. I mean, especially at the age of 20. Like, she's not even 21 yet. And I just think that, like, I don't know, like, I don't know, do you like my shirt? <laughs> Side note, I don't know. I just, I feel kind of bad for her, and um, I hope that she does find her way, and um, I hope that you know, things will get easier for her, but that performance was very, very unacceptable. And did you see how the Smith family was? Like, their family was like, the mom, I think, I think it was the mom that was like this the whole time, and um, Jaden, his name is, he was just kind of like, uh, like he was in shock. And um, Willow was kind of just like in shock too. And Will Smith is kind of like, oh. And it was just funny because like they showed you their performance or, or what they thought. Well, they showed a lot of the celebrities um, when she was performing. And everybody was either laughing at her or making fun of her or just like, oh my god, like what am I watching type thing. Um, also, 
um, what is up with the whole tongue thing? Can somebody please elaborate on that? Like, why does she go... Or, like, she'll smile and she'll stick her tongue out or... Um, like, she'll be standing there, like, really nice on the red carpet. She's like... <laughs> and then she just starts doing, like, all these weird things with her hands. And, um... Then someone said that she was trying to be like Gwen Stefani, which I don't think she looked anything like it. Maybe with the hair, with those like two little things. But other than that, I don't think her outfit was even close to Gwen Stefani. Just my opinion, that's all I'm going to say. But um, this is just all really my opinion in general. But a lot of people have actually agreed with me on all of this. I just don't understand the tongue thing and rolling around on the floor with her tongue out. Like, why does she do that? It's so unattractive and it's not even sexy or cute or anything. It's just like, oh, like, whore, put your fucking tongue back in your mouth. Like, we don't want to see it. Like, we don't, we just don't care. How about that? Like, you say we can't stop? Well, we don't care. <laughs> well, at least I don't. And if you want to judge me, that's fine, but I don't know, I just think about all the little people that watch her and I don't know, I can't help it, I care about people and I don't want other people to start rolling off of drugs and dancing with gigantic booty bears and whatever the fuck they were, coming out of a big gigantic bear and what she was, and what was she doing? <laughs> like twerking right but then she's like this on the floor you find you're not gonna be able to see this because it's dark oh she's like rolling around on the floor ow that hurt mm. okay so note number whatever it does not feel good laying on a hardwood floor that's what she said oh on the side note this rug smells so nice <laughs> because it's brand new and it smells good don't judge us okay so oh, I should end this because it's getting lengthy and I'm just ranting now about how I feel about this whole Miley thing but really let me know in the comments below what you feel about her performance did you like it did you hate it did you were you like what the fuck am I watching like I did um, I think Miley needs to get back on the climb. Just do it, girl. Get back up on the climb. It's the climb. You sung it, right? I don't know. Leave me your comments below. Let me know what you think. And until next time, be cool, be kind, don't judge. Although, I guess you can say I'm judging a little. <sighs> but... Bon appetit, and I don't know, just don't, I don't know, you can judge, I guess, because I totally just did, but just do it with love. <laughs> I'm doing it to look out for her. I'm 32 years old. She's 20. I'm doing it. I'm just looking out for you, Miley. That's it. We all want you to just be back to Smiley Miley and not this hyped up bear twerking, tongue out, whore, which it's not really a good image for you. I don't like it. Sorry, but I'm not sorry. Anyway, leave me in the comments below what you guys think. Don't forget to like this, subscribe. Don't forget to comment below what you think. And um, don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Twitter and like my Facebook page. And anything else that there is, I think that's all, but just in case, whatever. Um, yeah, do those things, because, you know, it helps me out a great deal, and I love you guys every day for it. But, um, <clears throat> okay, I'm going to go, because I can't really feel my throat. Odd. Anyway. Um, okay, so yeah, leave me some, oh, also leave me some topics, what you want me to talk about. I love you guys so much, and, um, oh, oh, 
Oreo has a mess on the floor. Oh, gosh. Okay, I love you guys. Be cool. Be kind. Don't judge. Be, be kind to yourselves. And um, what kind of beaver are you? Bye! Ding! Daily Grace. I wonder what Grace thinks. I'm going to ask her. Bye.